All right, guys, here's the video of my elevator. I'm just showing that up there. See how it seals all the way around. This is the safety latch. Release it. goes into the jab that snaps into those holes automatically and it'll catch this latch which I can do with these cords it in track every direction you got side rollers your side rollers keep it from going this way and then these rollers keep it from going in and out towards the wall it just follows this track and i built that track and it's sandwiched in between five studs two by six studs to keep it all secure and then of course when you have it up and the latch hits I'm going to go up a little bit and throw it. Now all the weight is on the, the studs in the wall until you get this. And then now the weight's transferred to this beam that's against the wall here. And then so all the weight's on that. So I've got that all lagged into the foundation there. I also do uh, also have a bunch of attachments that I put on this thing. I'll show you those here in a second. Or I can just use it for a bench when I need to. I've got this hoist attachment that goes on here. I've got a little pin there that'll pin right into it to hold it. And I throw a couple bolts in there. This way or tilt it this way, I can tighten it up right there. And then that way I can raise and lower whatever I have to be, whatever I have clamped in there. 
so I can put it wherever I want. have a motorcycle lift attachment I can put on there. I can go ahead and take that bike upstairs if I want to. And pretty much all the bikes I got will fit up there. still have a bike lift that I made for this thing. We usually store this over underneath that other bench, but I got it on wheels so I can roll around. Even with a bike on it, it'll roll around so I can detach it from the lift. If I need to use the elevator for something else while I got a bike on here, I can drop the elevator and detach this from the elevator. Now I can use it as a bike lift. So you can raise it all the way up as far as you want. Go to the ant bar just to see them. That way I made this so you can work on both sides of it. There's of course this beam that you know, can get in the way a little bit, but that's about it. Works pretty handy for building bikes that working on changing the oil or whatever you want to do. And it just works pretty slick.
course, I've got different notches with different spots. Like there's a spot where you generally would be working on a whole lot of things about that height. So, but you can put it at any height you want. I've had big bikes on there too. I had the soft tail, I got a soft tail I built on that. So it'll lift them, no problem. Works pretty slick. And of course you can just fuzz these back. You guys can roll around the shop pretty, pretty easily. And that's about it. I can't think of anything else. Time for a beer. Thanks. <laughs>